Bismillahirrahmanirrahim. everyone. I'm highly thankful to Applied Zoological Society of Pakistan and Khwaja Farid University of Engineering and Information Technology for providing me this opportunity to share my work with scientific community at 5th International Conference on Applied Zoology 2022. I'm Dr. Samreen Gul Khan from Department of Chemistry, GC University, Faisalabad. Today, the topic of my research work is synthesis and anti-cancer activity of novel one to four triazole derivatives. Triazoles are heterocyclic compounds containing three nitrogen atom and two carbon atom. Depending upon the position of these two nitrogen atoms, it has two different isomers this one to four isomer and one to three isomer. One to four triazole is reported to have significant activities like anti-cancer, anti-fungal, anti-inflammatory, antimicrobial, antibacterial, etc. Here are some drugs available in market having one to four triazole common in them, like these are different antifungal drugs, and here is a list of different anti-cancer drugs and antiviral as well as anti-migraine. Here is overall scheme of my work. I took an organic acid and it was converted into its respective ester by reaction with ethanol and in the presence of sulfuric acid, using it as the catalyst then this ester was converted into its respective hydroxide. And this hydroxide was then cyclized into its respective triazole. Then this triazole was reacted with a series of different and substituted acetamides. And after successful reaction, they gave us a series of different triazole coupled acetamide derivatives. Here is a list of different six derivatives. They are different in position of these groups. I have attached some electron donating as well as electron withdrawing groups. Formation of compound work is was confirmed by their spectral data analysis like this. It's the proton anion of the compound. It's the aromatic region. You can clearly see different peaks for aromatic protons. Is the C13 NMR of compound? After successful synthesis, compound were checked for their anti cancer activity against HEP2 cancer cell line cell. Results were very promising, especially compound 6B and 6D showed excellent activity with lowest IC50 value. Is the, uh, this table showed percentage inhibition against HEPG2 cell line cell of different 6A to 6F. We have used different concentration of these compounds. Is the graph showing percentage inhibition? You can clearly see that 6B and 6D were having promising results. Compound were also checked through in silico modeling using uh, C-kit tyrosine kinase as a active protein. Here, compound 6D was found to have excellent result in, in silico modeling as well. So we conclude We have synthesized a series of one to four triazole coupled acetamide derivatives. All derivatives were checked for their anti-proliferative activity against Hep 2 liver cancer cells. Among all derivatives, compound 6B and 6D containing electron donating methyl substituent at different position of aryl ring showed the best cell viability 
with lowest IC50 value of 13 and 12 micromolar respectively. Mechanism of inhibition of compound was further studied by in silico modeling and all results were in accordance with our biological finding. So we conclude that compound 6B and 6D could be utilized as a lead compound in cancer therapy in near future. Thank you for your attention.